the supporters and Neil Lennon you know, will uh, address the crowd. Turning to non-football matters uh, first, how important is the, uh, the backing you've had throughout this club been to you personally? Well, it's been um, a great source of comfort and uh, an inspiration really, not just to me but to my backroom staff, the board and, um, and certainly the players. This is what, why we love this club. You've seen today what the supporters bring. They've been magnificent all season. Talking of that incredible uh, Celtic support, how important is that uh, to you and uh, to the team going forward next season? Well, for me, this is just, this isn't the end, this is just the beginning. You've, uh, you've brought the style and the passion back and uh, are you looking forward to taking that through to the Scottish Cup final next Saturday? Well of course we're, you know, the reason I took this job on was they win silverware, it's um, a disappointing day today. We've got one more piece of silverware to win and the players will be given everything to do, bring back something for their efforts this season. We, um, we as a club, we as a club this season have nothing to reproach ourselves for. The, the board, the supporters, the players, they've, they've dealt with a lot of issues with great dignity. The players have played with real panache and style. We've tried to entertain all season. I think a lot of other people in the game here need to have a good look at themselves in the mirror. We, uh, we want to wish you all the very best for next Saturday. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Neil Lennon. A remarkable reaction to the Celtic manager as he made that uh, statement under interview. And he's talking already about next week and next season as the players receive their acclaim around the stadium. The flag's waving over Tommy Burns, and that's appropriate on the anniversary of his sad departure from us. Uh, 